is a boa constrictor, and it comes from the forests and jungles of Central and South America. And this one's probably about six feet. You can see by its skin that it's camouflaged. It hides at the bottom of trees under the roots, and it also hides in small burrows. This animal is cold-blooded, which means that he's about the same temperature as the outside surroundings. You can see its tongue coming out once in a while, and that's how it smells. It'll pick up particles of air and put it inside its mouth on an organ. It's also got heat sensing pits on the front of its mouth. Um, and with that and its tongue, it can detect when its prey comes by and it'll capture it and it'll wrap around it and constrict it so it can't breathe anymore. How big do they usually get? They can get up to 20 feet. Would they ever go back after people? Um, if they were frightened, they might strike at you, but they wouldn't ever try to eat you. We're much too big for them. You can see that they don't have eyelids. Um, snakes have scales over their eyes, and so when they shed, they shed the scales over their eyes as well. And you can also see that his eyes match the camouflage on his face to keep him hidden. A lot of people are afraid of snakes because they think they're slimy. They look shiny, kind of like fish, and they have scales. But if you feel it, it feels kind of like a basketball. Can we touch him? Yes, you can. Snakes are an important part of the ecosystem because they eat lots of small animals and so it keeps things like rodents under control so they don't get too large of a population. 